What's up gang, this is Hatayat7RCT bringing you another video this time around. Gonna be doing a little active testing here because uh, right after I did the video on JJ the King 45 and his aura builds, he laid down the 1.1 update to the Samurai Showdown one, which of course I felt like crap because I should have covered this one to begin with. But fortunately, uh, you know, we can make as many videos as needed. I don't have any problem with that. So basically today what I'm going to be covering is the update. Now he told me uh, uh, straight up that this one does not include the PlayStation 1. Uh, Warriors Rage I believe it is. Um, and he told me that it could be added. But I feel that I'm not going to miss it personally. Myself I'm not going to miss it that much because you know it's not really part of the uh, mainline titles so to speak. Um, that is a port that was done from the Hyper 64. And of course, it doesn't even come close to to the arcade original. So, that being said, the only one missing here so far, and I would like to experiment later on to add, would be the Atomus Wave one, which is Samurai Showdown Six. That being said, this is the complete collection, and uh, yeah, I did a little bit of. Uh, I mean, I'm I'm running it as is because this really does not need anything else. Uh, you can tell that you know it's been uh, worked on we have how model here a floating how model which looks absolutely uh, absolutely cool and yeah we have all the mainline titles right here and these are the ones that matter at least for the Samurai Shodan fan yeah we we got what we need here now straight up uh, the only thing that I have changed is um, the controls which are very easy to do well, within MAME itself, the MAME UI um, once the game is running and I did just a simple change and it's really good because that way when I change from the Xbox One controller to the uh, tournament stick it's just a matter of rearranging the buttons on the tournament stick I like to use more the you know, original Neo Geo forward button in a straight line kind of configuration. So, and of course I'm starting in reverse here because I'm starting with my favorite one and then check out the other ones. Now the only other change that I did personally to, to mine was the scan lines. I mean, I still have the original build that has the scan lines, but you know, me getting old and stuff like that, scan lines, I really don't need it. It, 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 it makes me feel a little bit like it's a darker image. Um, and for the purpose of recording, it actually looks uh, a bit better. I don't know. It's, it's a matter of taste preference. The thing is that I just use the principles of the CoinOps uh, builds and just check to see how the auto changer worked in changing the different effects. And I just apply that to eliminate the scan lines and yeah now I have it basically the way that I would enjoy it the most that being said this is it guys I mean this is like the Samurai Showdown fans wet dream and I know there's been a lot of compilations and collections out there but I don't know there's something about playing the arcade games of it that's just so freaking appealing Now, of course, a lot of purists are going to say that, you know, the best way to play it is with the original. And I'm not going to argue that. I mean, playing the original titles, it's awesome. And if you can do it, then more power to you. But I'm telling you right now, if you don't have that heap of cash that you can, you're going to need to get the actual titles, each and every one of them, this is the next best thing, in my opinion. Now, it would have been nice if I... Ideally, I would have loved testing this with the actual arcade stick. However, given that with the microphone setup and stuff, 
if I would have done that, then all you would hear is a clickety clackety of the Sanwa buttons on the stick, so rather go low key. So yeah, this is Sam Show 5 Special. Let's go back in the menu. Now, um, for those of you with um, sharp eyes, you're going to notice that right here, we have uh, he has replaced basically the, the controller configuration screen with some nice video here. And we go back here. Let me try one more. Oh, wait. Let's try go with number two. Another one of the old time favorites. And again, everything works nicely. And for this one, let's go, let's go with Galfo. Galfurodo. Good, not good. Damn, Hanso is making short work of me right here. Damn. Hattori Hanzo. I love these games. That backfired. <laughs> At least I got a round off. Let's go to another one, the last one, to end this video. Let's go to four. on this one uh, no I'm gonna stick with slash all right let's skip the formalities and go right into the fight Damn, not good. Damn! Didn't even get a chance to do the special.
I got this. I got, or better yet, Genjiro got this. Come on, Genjiro. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Well, guys, that is going to be all for this straight up gameplay testing of the most recent Sam Show um, Aura build from JJ the King 45. Really awesome stuff. Later on, I'll do some more on these. Got the Street Fighter one, which is gonna take a while, and the Mario Collection even more so, cause they're content packed. And looking forward for uh, more of the uh, JJ uh, the King 45 uh, builds. They're awesome. They're completely, completely awesome. So check them out when you get a chance. <laughs>